Hi there, I'm John from cncrr.com and today we make a custom woodworking template. Templates are something that I use here in the shop all the time, so I'm not only a provider of templates, I'm also my own customer of templates. In this case here, the customer needed something like this here at a specific diameter. And the reason for this is because they're doing inlays in their work. And what you do is with an inlay, you put this on to whatever countertop or other kind of work you need, and you get your router and you cut it out with your normal hand router. Now they're not doing too many of these, so we just use quarter inch MDF as you can see here. And as I had my router working on other projects, I just decided to use the laser to cut it. And that's the nice thing about the stuff that I do is because I have multiple CNC platforms, I don't really have to wait for one to finish to start the other one. It also means that I can do them in multiple materials. So let's say instead of doing like two or three inlays, which is, this is totally fine for, this is actually overkill even for that. Um, let's say you need to do, you know, a thousand inlays in wood, in wood or what have you. Well, then we could cut this out with the plasma cutter and we could actually cut it out of stainless steel. And then it's exactly the same spec. CNC is a CNC at the end of the day. Uh, only the material is different. It's incredible how much woodworking actually happens around town and around the world. Um, I always get astonished by it because I don't think I do all that much woodworking. And then you, know, you meet other woodworkers and they give you ideas of stuff. And they're like everywhere. Um, something I found kind of interesting is a lot of firefighters are actually woodworkers because they have really long hours and then they have a lot of days off, you know, to compensate for those long hours that they do. Uh, so a lot of them are actually woodworkers and we do a lot of work with them, either flattening their live edge tables or making templates as you see here using the laser. Um, as to the difference between the different machines, you know, an inch and a half using a router for a diameter or an inch and a half using a laser is pretty much identical. Uh, same thing goes with the plasma cutter. So an inch and a half is an inch and a half is an inch and a half. And that's really cool because that means that if you have multiple projects on the go and you need something quick and dirty and then you need something that can last a little bit longer, we can make you know, different versions of the same template or different templates for to use. The nice thing about steel, uh, we made them out of mild steel and stainless steel. The nice thing about stainless steel is that it's a lot more corrosive resistance. But for this kind of application, mild steel is totally fine. Even if it rusts a little bit, doesn't really matter. Just put a little bit of sandpaper over it and clean it up, and then you can use it as your template. So I do a lot of woodworking here in the shop as well, metalworking, plastic working, and so forth. Uh, but this kind of stuff is actually pretty simple to tell me what you want. All you have to do is tell me, in this case here, the customer said, okay, here's the diameter of the hole that we need, and here's roughly what we're trying to achieve. Uh, so I came back to them and I said, well, nine inch square is totally fine. Uh, for your application. It's easy to hold down. You can put double-sided tape if you want. You can put just normal tape. You can use a glue gun. It's, it's really straightforward. You can even actually use clamps to hold down the corners. So this can be literally any size, any shape, any diameter, or any sort of circumference. And the inner diameter is a specific diameter that they needed uh, for their job. Uh, but then again, this could have been placed over here, over here. You could have even multiple holes. Um, it doesn't really matter to me how many holes you put into this as long as it's dimensionally stable, which means that when you're running your router over it, you don't want to be worried about if you have too many holes or things that the router can sort of catch on. So that's something to keep in mind. So if you're looking for custom templates for basically anything, contact me at cncri.com. We'll make them for you and ship them right to your door.